All right, Arby's has a new Cajun fish wrap. Check it out. Is this any good? I don't know. Let's find out. What's going on? It's your boy Big Ben. We back again with something new. You already know if something new just came out with us, something new we gotta talk about. People, today we got something new from Arby's. Arby's dropped some new hush breaded fish strips in a new Cajun fish wrap was debating between the two, and I said, you know what, let me check out this Cajun fish wrap. Seems a little unique. I also wanna check out the fish strips. Let me know if you guys wanna see that. Drop in the comment box below, but right now we're checking out the Cajun fish wrap. Got it here? Arby's known for the meats. The fish though? The fish? I did check out the spicy fish. That was pretty good. Um, so let's see what this is all about. The marketing picture and everything looked pretty good. Um, but apparently the fish has like, it's breaded in this hush puppy coating. So that's kind of interesting already. Um, and the fish wrap has this Cajun seasoning on it. Comes about yay big. Okay, let's unwrap it here. All right, you guys, check this thing out. This is the new Cajun fish wrap. It has three Cajun seasoned hush puppy breaded fish strips in here, topped with shredded lettuce, tomato, and zesty Cajun remoulade spread on an artisan wrap. Interesting. Now it's a little pricey. It's $6.49, but nowadays, what isn't pricey? You know what I mean? What's not pricey? Um, and then you know, respect the calories. Calories for this little wrap. It's 740 calories, okay? Um, all right, you guys, nothing else to do but to do the review, the new Cajun fish wrap. Let's check it out. First bite. Before I locked down all the way, was the flavor of the fish, the seasoning, that was good. Hmm. Wow. The fish seasoning, guys, is hitting. It's like Cajun, Cajun fish. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm digging this. I don't like the wrap all the way. It's not terrible. I think I've had other wraps, like a cranberry Thanksgiving wrap, something like that. Yeah, something like that. But um, it's not terrible, but right now it's kind of it's kind of trying to trying to compete with the star of the show, which is a Cajun fish. It's trying to compete with it. I want more of this Cajun fish. Um that remoulade, I I know I'm saying that wrong. Maybe marmalade. Lady marmalade is popping in my my mind that song but that uh yeah that remoulade spread however you pronounce it golly that's good too I, I think that's in there mixing with that cajun seasoning but i like this so far mm. Mm -hmm. this is it man i want more of the fish i want more of the fish i'm digging this what's gonna be my score for this thing What is going to be my score? Now, I, I'm going to say this right now because I got to make sure you guys know how I rank these things. This is being ranked as a Cajun fish at a fast food establishment like Arby's. Okay. I'm not saying if this can compete with your local, you know what I mean? Your place that throw down that fish, that fried fish on the corner. I'm not saying all that. Okay. I'm talking about an Arby's fast food. You want to try something new or you in the mood for something different or some Cajun fish. Exactly what they're talking about. That's, that's how I'm ranking this thing. I like it for that purpose. I want one more bite of this new half right here. Mm. 
just to confirm. Mm -hmm. This is good. Very first bite was a nine. Very unique. Second bite still good. For whatever reason, having this other bite, level set me a little bit. I'm giving this seven point, I would do eight, is it an eight? Is it an eight? It's a 7.5. I think the wrap does it a disservice. I would actually rather have this fish by itself. Ooh, the guy, this guy a little kick. Kick level is about from a one to 10. It's about a 5.5, maybe a six. It's not as, I don't think it's as spicy as that spicy fish I reviewed, but it has a nice kick. I like the seasoning. I actually just, I just want more of the fish, less of everything else. So now I gotta do a review of those uh, Hush Puppy breaded Fish strips because I like what Arby's is doing. I mean, Arby's is trying new stuff. They did the burgers, right? I reviewed those. Now they're doing the fish. Who knows what's next? I mean, maybe Arby's is gonna serve up some uh, filet mignon. Probably won't recommend it coming from that fast food establishment, but who knows? Who knows what's coming from Arby's next? But let me know what you guys think about this. If you try it out or if you are gonna try it out, what's your thoughts? Maybe drop a little comment, who got the best fish on the block? You know what I mean? Let me know what you guys think. But officially, that's the review as always. If you like the video, if you rock with me the whole time, please leave a like. Don't share once, share it twice and drop a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see next on the channel. And whether you're a regular or a first timer, please subscribe, hit that notification bell reminder. Catch you guys next time, eating something else. Peace.